After the Morphin, each ranger transforms into a different costume, but what changes the most is almost always the helmet. In several seasons of Power Rangers, the helmets are different for each ranger, and it all depends on the theme of that season. Today we won't talk about the costumes because even though the costume and helmet are a complete uniform, sometimes, the costumes are all the same and only the colors change. However, helmets change most of the time. Today we'll talk about the best helmets I've seen in Power Rangers. Leave in the comments your favorite helmets and remember that each ranger has a different helmet, so you can mention the season and the color of the ranger. I'm going to start with my favorite helmet and it's on my favorite ranger. The Black Ranger from Mighty Morphin with the Mastodon Helmet. This season we know that the theme is prehistoric animals, and the Black Ranger has the power of the Mastodon. This is an extinct animal that was like a hairy elephant with big tusks. That is why the helmet has two tusks on the sides and in the center, it has lines like the Mastodon's trunk. As a curious fact, Many people confuse the Mastodon with the Mammoth and they are not the same animal, although they are very similar. My second favorite helmet is the Mighty Morphin White Ranger helmet as it has a nice color combination with white, gold and black. This Ranger's power comes from the White Tiger and if we look at the top of the helmet, we will see the lines that the White Tiger has on his head. This is a subtle, but effective detail as it gives him that presence of the white tiger and therefore influences leadership. One of the changes that I really liked in this helmet is the part of the mouth, being flat without the shape of the lips then changed the perspective. Let's continue with Commander Kruger's helmet, which has the shape of the commander's two ears. The shape of the black visor gives it a very future style and combines very well with the shape of the ears. One detail that I really liked about all SPD Rangers is that they have the police insignia in the front of the helmet. This detail is very important as this season is based on a police style and they always wear the badge all over the uniform. The only thing we don't know about this helmet is how the commander can put his whole nose inside the helmet. This is a Power Rangers mystery. Another amazing helmet is the Dino Thunder White Ranger helmet, which has a fierce style. The theme of this season was dinosaurs and that is why the style should be with many cuts and lines to look like dinosaur markings. Even though this helmet is quite simple, it has something that makes it spectacular and that is that the visor of the helmet is red and has an incredible shape. Another thing is that it has a wing on the top that is very similar to those of your dinosaur. From this same season we must also mention the Black Ranger and basically for the same reasons. In this case the helmet is black with golden details. In the Jungle Fury season there are two Rangers that have very striking helmets that carry the name of the series very well. The Purple Ranger and the Red Ranger both of which have a very wild design and make you feel like you are inside the jungle. The red one is a simpler helmet with only two colors, yet the lines and design look great. Also, the red and black colors are colors that make you feel empowered and something very wild like the theme of the season. The purple one has a design on the sides that makes the helmet very different from the others, Plus it has a combination of three colors. Explaining these designs is a bit complicated, but just looking at them is enough to know that they are very good. 
Finally, the season that had the best helmets was Power Rangers Wild Force. This season has six rangers and four of those rangers have spectacular helmets. We can start with the Black Ranger's helmet that has a very similar design to his animal. The Black Ranger's power comes from the bison, a very large and powerful animal with small horns. The bison is dark in color and so it suits the Black Ranger. Plus the helmet also has the small horns of the bison. Those little horns give it a very different detail than all the other helmets in the franchise. Next is the Red Ranger helmet which has the power of the lion. What I like most about this helmet is that when we see it face to face, we can see the lion's gaze and that causes intimidation to the enemy. We can see the yellow eyes, nose and fangs of the lion in the visor of the helmet. The colors of this helmet are very simple, but its design is so good that it doesn't need to have many colors to look amazing. After that we have the Silver Ranger helmet, which has the power of the wolf. Just like the Red Ranger design, this helmet we can also see the look of the animal, but here we have a mix of colors that makes the helmet look modern and wild at the same time. The ears, the fangs on the helmet visor and the red eyes, also causes intimidation to the enemy. Finally, the White Tiger is repeated, and the White Ranger of this season has one of the best helmets in the history of the franchise and the impressive thing is that even though it has an animal that was already used in the series previously, even so, its design was spectacular. In this helmet they use again the lines of the tiger's head, but the pink color gives it a special and feminine touch. The big yellow eyes stand out very well in the design and the silver jaw gives it a very wild touch as well. If you like helmets, like this video, and subscribe to this channel, for more Power Rangers designs.